Uh, hopefully we can get something decent. Oh my god, we got a walkout. That's 15k pack. What? What? It's gonna be an 86 plus. What's it gonna be? Brazilian. Left wing. <gasps> no! How is it going, everybody? And welcome back to a brand new video. We've got the FIFA shirt on, and you know what that means. We have got division rival rewards. We have got a few different rewards to open, of course, for your share play. So we're gonna jump straight into it, and I'm super excited actually to open these rewards. One thing I'm not excited about is the fact that I used to wake up at 7 to open these rewards. I'd wake up, have a shower, get some breakfast, and by like 7.50 the rewards came out and the video would be up by like half 8, 9. Because the clocks went back, I had to wake up at 6 this morning. So if I am extra tired this episode, you know why. You know exactly why. So let's jump straight into the rewards. Uh, we're on my account first of all, the Road of Glory, of course. We're going to go with the four mega packs. I just didn't have time to play past rank three. Sadly, um, I, well, not sadly, but I've been, I've been moving house, you can tell by the background. Uh, so I just did not have time to um, get the better reward, sadly. Uh, however, we do have four mega packs. Maybe we get lucky. I don't know. Probably not. Not expecting to get lucky, but if we do, I'll be excited. Um, and I do like the new ring animation, how it like spins around as we get a board drop, actually. Dutch striker. Send it back, Van Dyke. I wish that was Van Dyke, man. That would have been so lit if that was Van Dyke. And a tradable Van Dyke would not go and miss right now. But we'll take the three, 84 rated. All decent for SBCs, of course. Um, I'm trying to do a few SBCs on the account right now. So all these cards are fantastic. Um, but of course, we get all of these consumables as well, which helps the club massively. Uh, I'm a big fan of consumables, so we'll take it. And, uh, and you know what? The four mega packs, although it's not really the luckiest in terms of actual packs, it's decent for like you know, stacking the club. I'm a fan of it for stacking the club, so that's not bad. As we get another board drop, it's going to be English. It's going to be a goalkeeper. It's going to be Pickford. Completely forgot who was an English goalie board drop then, but you know what? We'll take it. And I want to ask your opinion right now. Let me know in the comments down below. Bigger card or smaller card in terms of the pack animation? Which one do you prefer? I'm interested to hear your, your opinions. I actually prefer the bigger card. I don't know why. I think I just prefer like how much of the screen it fills. I think that's a lot better. Uh, as we get three dupes that will just discard for zero coins. We've got two more mega packs left on my account. Um, and of course, we have gold one rewards to open later tonight on my uh, account for foot champs. As well as, I think, elite one rewards as well, which is fantastic. So, we will be opening those as we get Wayne Rooney in a pack. Would have liked that to be Vardy, but you know what? It's not too bad. It is not too bad. So, we'll, uh, we'll open those later as well. I just want to quickly say as well, a lot of people have been commenting on the little scruff that I have. A lot of people have been calling me homeless. I just want you to know, in like three months from now, I'm going to look like Nick2018 in the Penthes, and none of you guys are going to be able to say anything about it, all right? So just keep your comments to yourself as we open our last mega pack, and it's not going to be a board drop, which means it's going to be a skip pack, and uh, and that sucks. But we're going to jump over onto SharePlay now and go to Simon's account and, uh, and open his rewards, and hopefully we get better rewards than what I just got, because... I think I just got a bit of doo-doo right there. We're on Simon's account now, and if history is anything to go by, we will pack something incredible on Simon's account. He, of course, got Division 2 Rank 3 rewards, which gives you the best rewards out of Division 2 for some reason. We get four 50k packs and two mega packs, which is just insane rewards, if you ask me. But, like, he really, he had to play two games, I think, to stay in, uh, in Rank 3. It's crazy. Like, you can literally just play Weekend League in two Div Rival games and get the best rewards all week. It's so silly. He ain't need to fix that, in my opinion. However, first place is going to be a board drop. It's going to be... Ooh, it's going to be Chesney, actually. Uh, 84 rated. Not bad. I think that's the best one you can get a Polish guy that's not a walkout. So, it's not too shabby. It's not It's not bad at all. And Murata. You know what? That's not bad. That's a good start. A couple of board drops there for uh, potential SBCs down the line. So, we'll take it. Uh, and we have another mega pack, of course. Can we get anything good from the other mega pack? That is a question. It's not going to be a walkout, sadly. But... Can we get a board drop? No, we can't. So we got one board from the Mega Packs. Of course, we have 50k packs now, though, which are uh, which are exciting in my opinion. So uh, we'll go ahead and open those in just a second. I want to see if this guy's tradable. Actually, is he tradable? No, he's not. We'll just uh, we'll just send him to the discard pile, and we'll open the four 50k packs now. Of course, Simon as well got Elite One rewards, which we'll be opening for foot champs later on today, which will be really exciting. So we have a bunch of red informed packs or player pick packs to open later today. We've got a bunch of 100k packs, a bunch of team of the week packs. I'm excited as we get a Brazilian board drop. It's going to be Felipe, the center back from Porto. It's just not great. It's not fantastic. However, we do have three of the 50k packs to possibly redeem the pack. Look, I think, you know what? Like, if we get a few boards here and we maybe get like an 85, possibly an 86 if we're lucky, I think that'll be 
uh, a decent uh, decent haul of players because you know potential SBCs coming out soon. We've got Black Friday in three weeks, which means we'll probably get some SBCs then. We've got uh, a potential play like icon player pick set three to come in like a, uh, three or four weeks time as well, which as well will make it very useful for these kind of cards. So. Yeah, should be decent as well. So we don't get a, board, uh, a walkout, sorry, and we don't even get a board drop in the in the second 50k pack. That's disappointing. From a 50k pack, you expect at least a board drop. So that that's quite sad. That, in my opinion, is just not good at all. I'm not happy about that. Uh, let's go ahead and open the last two. Come on, EA. Give us at least an 86 plus in one of these, please. From four 50k packs. Yes, we got one. Let's go. We got a walkout. Come on. It's going to be an 86 plus card. It's going to be German. Cam, Meza Erzil, 86 rated, not bad at all, we'll take it, that is really, really decent, happy with that, don't know what kind of market value he holds, I think I packed him the other day actually, uh, I can't remember how much he sold for, I think it was like 20,000 coins, regardless, it's an 86 rated for potential SBCs down the line and stuff like that, so that is decent, what's he going for right now, if Footbin, uh, you know what, Footbin never works at this time because everybody's opening up their rewards and searching about how, many, how much players go for on the market, I'm assuming he's about 20,000 coins, that is not a bad pack at all, actually. 83 rated uh, Trigueros there as well, but that's decent. We'll take it. It's an untradeable, so we'll uh, we'll shove it in the club and we'll uh, we'll discard the uh, the other three. One more 50k pack left. Can we get another 86 plus? That would be crazy. If we get back to back walkouts, that would be nuts. Yes, we did. We got back to back walkouts. No way. It's gonna be another 86 plus card. What's it gonna be? Ooh, it's gonna be all black, I think. No, Handanovic. I always get them mixed up. I apologize. It's gonna be 88 rated on Handanovic. That is incredible. Back-to-back -back walkouts. 88 Handanovic and 86 Urzil. There could also be something else decent in this pack. That, in my opinion, is pretty decent. So, uh, let's see what else we can get. Can we get a second walkout in the same pack? No, we cannot. We've got Glick, Pepe Reina, and Castillo, though. Or Castillejo, even. So, not a bad pack at all. That is... Decent rewards on Simon's account. Simon always has decent looking rewards, so not bad at all. We'll happily take that. Let's go ahead and get the next rewards opened. Alright, we're on the money account now on the Xbox. This is my account real quick. I don't actually know. Okay, I finished rank 4. So I don't even get a choice. That's how poorly I finish. But we get 3,500 coins. <sighs> Big money. Big money moves. Um, <laughs> what else do we get? Two gold packs and a 15k pack. We're just opening these for the memes. We, if we get a walkout in any of these packs, I'll be shocked. We actually got a rare, which is already good. So we're probably just going to end up discarding all of these packs, though. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Uh, are they tradable? Oh, they are tradable. You know what? We'll take it. We'll, we'll take the 1.6k. Thank you very much. We'll take all the coins. Come on. Throw them all at me. Imagine we got a walkout in the 15k pack. I would be genuinely astonished. Genuinely astonished. From, from from rank 4, Division 5. I played two games this weekend to show you how little people are playing in Div 5, I guess. Or does that mean that a lot of people are playing Div 5? I'm not entirely sure. Regardless, let's open our 15k pack. It's not going to be a walkout as expected. Probably won't be a board drop either. Uh, no, it won't. So uh, we'll just quickly skip that and actually open some real rewards now. Now it's time to open Joel's rewards. Joel has requested that I pack him an icon. Not difficult things then. Uh, we've got rank one in division five, I want to say. Uh, I think this is division five. So we get four 15k packs, two 35s and two mega packs. No, they're the same thing. Two mega packs and two rare players packs. So we'll open these bad boys. Let's see if we can get anything good from these. So we'll start off with the 15k packs. Nothing too special in these. If we get a, uh, a walkout, I'd be very surprised. Although I did get a walkout in my 15k packs once from uh, rank 1, division 5. So anything is possible, I guess. Uh, regardless, we'll open these and see if we can get any good luck. Uh, we start off with an Ismaili. That is just not great at all. We'll uh, we'll send that to the club and discard the uh, the training item. Let's, uh, let's open the next Jumbo Premium Gold Pack. These packs feel like just filler packs. They feel like they'll just fill your club with some consumer. Oh, Inform. Hang on. Brazilian, please. Dutch, striker, the guy from Wolfsburg. Uh, is it Wolfsburg? I think that's Wolfsburg. Yeah, I w if he was Brazilian, it'd be Alex Pato. That's why I was uh, That's why I was asking for Brazilian. Um, oh, we got Sergio Berto in the same pack. You know, for a 15k pack, that is not bad at all. We'll take that. That is a decent 15k pack. And we get 1,000 coins. That is actually pretty decent. So as far as 15k packs go, that one ain't bad. That one ain't bad. Uh, as we get no walkout in the next one. Not expected, though. Not expected. Uh, no board drop either. Again, not expected. Um, 
but like I was saying, they just feel like filler packs. Like they fill your club up with so many consumables and and like uh, manager items and stuff like that. Uh, however, you don't really ever seem to get great players in them. Although there'll be that one guy in the comments that got like Icon Cruyff and Icon Hull in the same 15k pack like last week, and then this week he got like Prime Icon Pele in a 15k pack. You know, because there always is that guy um, that wants to try and prove me wrong with uh, with with apparently the best pack luck in the game. Um, but <laughs> we'll ignore that as we get back a Yoko. FIFA 18 Beast sadly has been nerfed. So, we've got two Mega Packs now. Let's see if we can get anything good from the Mega Packs. Come on, EA. Hook a brother up. It's not going to be a walkout in the first Mega Pack. I've just realised I've got a scratch on my desk as well. No idea what that's from, but we get a board drop. It's going to be Odinian Cam Benega. Not bad. Not bad. We'll take it. Uh, at least it's an 83 rated for... Uh, for, you know, any needs of an 83 rated card, I guess. Uh, we'll store that to the club and discard Mila Jovovich. That, that's a correct pronunciation, all right? It could be someone in the comments that says he's pronounced like Greg. But, you know, whatever. No walkout in the second 15k pack. Can we get a board drop? We do get a board drop. That's good. Uh, it's going to be Colombian. Right mid, Quadrado. Not bad, actually. Has a really good card this year. 91 pace, 87 dribbling with 5-star skill moves as well. Decent. I think he's got really poor stamina, though, which kind of sucks. Um, I think. Maybe I'm wrong, though. Yeah, 78 is not great. However, decent card all round. Uh, not bad. 5-star skills as well is great. And we've got Rui Patricio in that pack. So, we're down to the 250k packs now. Let's see if we can get anything good. Come on, EA. Hook your brother up. Give us a walkout, please. Not going to be a walkout in the first 15k pack, sadly. Can we get a board drop? It's going to be a board. What's it going to be? Spanish, ugh, you know it's going to be bad when it's Spanish. Juan Mata, not great. Not great, really. Not great. Disappointing, to say the least. Um, I guess we'll just store that to the club. Anson Taliska there as well. Yeah, not fantastic. However, we do have one more to redeem it. Come on, EA. Give us a walkout, please. Give us a walkout. Nope. No walkout, sadly. No walkout. Can it be a board at least? No board drop either. Ouch. That's painful. Fred, though. Fred is not bad. Fred is not bad. We'll take it. Fred is decent. So, not a bad pull there. I think he's like a 10, 15,000 coin card still. So, not too shabby. Apart from that, it's pretty bad. Uh, meh. Rewards were pretty mad on Joel's account today. Uh, hopefully, they get redeemed in Weekend League later on today. Let's open our, I think, last batch. Last batch of rewards now, Jim's real estate rewards, of course, as we do every week. I think he also got rank 1 in Div 5. So, we got two rank 1 rewards in this video, which is decent. Let's go ahead and open the packs up. So we'll start off with the 15K packs as usual. Uh, hopefully we can get something decent. Oh my God, we got a walkout. First 15K pack, what? What? It could be an 86 plus. What's it gonna be? Brazilian. Left wing. <gasps> no. Oh, I hate you, EA. I hate you so much. <laughs> oh my God, I thought, you lot thought it was Neymar. I thought it was Neymar. I thought it was Neymar. Oh, I hate you, EA. I actually hate you. EA Sports, what are you doing to me? You just gave me a heart attack. <sighs> okay, all right. Not bad. <laughs> wow. All right, we got Walkout in the 15K pack, which, first of all, is, you know, not quite that common. Wow, he's an expensive one as well. He's like 70,000 coins, roughly. That is fantastic. He's got five-star skills this year. Amazing card, if you ask me, apart from his uh, stamina and just physical in general. Him, if you put him at Cam, would be incredible. Wow. That is nuts. Okay. Whew. All right. That was exciting. We started off incredibly. First pack in. First 15K pack, and it's a walkout. So, you know what? Coutinho, not bad. I thought it was Neymar. You lot thought it was Neymar. We all thought it was Neymar. These rewards have been insane so far. We've had, what, back-to-back -back walkouts. We've had Coutinho in a 15k pack. Rewards have been pretty solid today. Rewards have been pretty solid today. That's all I'm saying. If that doesn't deserve a like, I don't know what does. I don't know what does in this, in this industry. I don't know what deserves a like anymore. If that does not deserve a like. So, that's all I'm saying. All right. So, we've got the next 15k pack now. It's not going to be a board drop, as expected. Um... What I found with rewards, and maybe you'll agree or disagree with these, is that once you get a walkout, it's very difficult to get another walkout or board drop in the rest of the packs. If you get a walkout early, like in a 15k pack, you'll find that the rest of your 15, 35, and 50k packs aren't that solid. But we do get an info on Brazilian. Go on. Go on. Italian. Center back. I don't know who this is. It's going to be Mancini. Is that Roberto Mancini's son? I don't know. Could be. Could not be. I don't know. Uh, regardless, uh, that's kind of like blew my theory out of the water, actually. 
Um, but yeah, I just, I don't know. I feel like it's harder to get better packs after you already get a walkout. Maybe I'm wrong though. Maybe that, like, that's just a silly theory. That's like a tinfoil hat kind of moment. Uh, but I thought I would uh, share that with you as we get a non-board drop in the 35k pack. But going by my theory, Bellerin's not bad though. Going by my theory, we should not get board drops now in the, in the, in the 35k packs and possibly 50k packs. However, hopefully my theory is wrong. I would love another couple of walkouts. I'm not going to lie. Uh, let's go into the next 35k pack. It's not going to be a walkout. Can it be a board drop at least? Not going to be a board drop, sadly. It's going to be a Brazilian centimid Fred. Fred again. Not bad. I, you know what? I don't think I've packed Fred very often this year. To pack him twice in the space of like 10 minutes is not bad. We'll take that. Uh, we'll go ahead and discard that kit. Now we have the 250k packs to round off the video. Let's see if we can get anything good from either of these 50k packs. Come on, EA. Give us a walkout in one of them. Not in the first one, not in the first pack. Could it be a decent board drop? It's going to be Montenegro. It's going to be Savage. Okay, you know what? That just is not fantastic. That, that's not great. That is not great. We've got Lingard as well. That's disappointing. Okay, last 50k pack of the video. Come on, EA. Hook a brother up. Let's even get another walkout. If we do, I'll be very surprised and quite happy as well. Let's see. Go on. Go on. Go on. Nope, no, no walkout. Disappointing, but no walkout. It's going to be a board drop nonetheless. It's going to be Brazilian centre-back. David Luiz? Yo, that's not bad. Oh, he's 83 rated. I thought he was like 85 still. I thought he was like 85, 86 rated then. Eh, it's all right. It's okay, I guess. It's 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 not bad. We get Robertson there as well. Uh, maybe he's got a tradable Robertson than myself for a couple of K. He does. Uh, Diallo, we actually already got in this rewards video so we'll go ahead and discard that but if that is it for the rewards if you guys did enjoy smash a like down below subscribe to the channel if you guys are new around here stick around because tonight we'll have foot jumps rewards make sure you go check them out elite one gold one gold three gold two gold everything literally everything under the sun will have so make sure you check that, that out thank you for watching and i'll see you lads later